St. Nicholas Greek Orthodox Church, which stood in the shadow of the World Trade Center, was destroyed during the September 11th terror attacks. Now exactly 22 years later, the House of Worship held its first 9-11 service since reopening last year. It's now a national shrine dedicated to the victims of the terrorist attacks. Joining us now is Father Andreas Vifukas, the presiding priest at St. Nicholas. Father, thank you so much for joining us. My pleasure. Thank you. So this church is a stunning structure. It was designed by Santiago Calatrava, who also worked on the Oculus. Uh, and it's really become a place where people can reflect on 9-11 and everything that happened. When people come to the church, what do you want them to take away? Well, firstly, uh, I think that people will appreciate the beautiful architecture, the traditional Byzantine style that is modeled after the famous church in uh, Constantinople, in modern day Istanbul, Saint Sophia, where uh, Senor Calatrava uh, had his inspiration for building this church. And, uh, and also, but also beyond the, the architecture and the art, which is really inspiring and beautiful, to be able to take away the fact that this church is built as a memorial to the victims that perished on September 11th. And so that we can continue to remember them, to remember their tremendous sacrifice, and to also offer a place, a home, for their loved ones, their family, their survivors that uh, are able to come here to say a prayer for them, to remember them, and to offer uh, a place of hope and love uh, and that overcomes the evil that took place here on that day. And you know, how powerful was it to be there more than 20 years later back in that location again today? It was, it's really, I, I really can't believe it. I'm, I'm always, uh, just being in this location is, is uh, something that goes beyond, beyond words. I remember that day I was in the city when, when this attack happened. And I always felt in my heart that I wanted to somehow be able to give back to our community, to be able to serve the people of New York, to serve the people of, of our community, and to be able to help, you know, show the love of God and that, that there is goodness in humanity. And uh, God allowed me to have, with the blessing of His Eminence Archbishop El Pidoforos, to have this position here today where I'm able to share that love that uh, that overcomes the evil and the hatred that took place on that day and it's uh, it's tremendous for me to be in this position to share that with not only the the people who are orthodox or christians but with all people all nationalities all religions uh, everyone is welcome to come through the doors and to experience our tradition and to experience and to remember the sacrifice of all those three thousand people that sacrificed their lives on that day that's an absolutely amazing father, a beautiful church, and I'm just so happy to see that your doors are open once again. Thank you for joining us. Absolutely. Thank you.